Welcome to another wrenching and riding vlog, 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 whatever they call these things nowadays with a video. I just thought I'd show you what I've been doing in the shed yesterday. Um, doing something I really, really don't like doing a lot of, and that is stick welding. Look at that. Welding. I did my trade in the aircraft industry. Uh, welding stainless steel with TIG. Love TIG. I actually have a TIG set up. Yay! Love the stuff. Uh, nice clean welds out of that. But I thought I'd, I need to make a bracket for my um, bike hoist to keep the front, air, front wheel up in the air. So I go and get some uh, C-channel from Bunnings, grind the gal off once I cut it all up because yeah, you can really horrible to weld through gal. And um, look at that. That stick, my stick welding. Shit. Atta shit. But anyway, that doesn't matter. It works. It's functional. It's like anything I do. It's functional and it works. Shout out to Paul at Drifter Bikes for putting me on to the bike hoist. Um, really simple, wind up mechanical thing, but I just wanted to be a bit more secure with the front wheel uh, hanging off a bracket. Uh, you can take that off, unbolt it, uh, take it off, and to move the forks around. It just makes it all a lot more secure. I can see, you know, I can work on it better. It saves my poor old back from, um, yeah, after so many years. 39 years of working on bikes, um, you just get a sore back from bending over all the time. So ta-da, it's ugly, it's messy, but it works and it's functional, I love it. And you probably saw on the Scorpio, it's got a slightly different tank, slightly different tape. Doing it a little bit different, that's what I always do, change things around until I'm finally happy. So anyway, that's it, thank you, bye.